literally the next sift. Oh my oh. goodness. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Oh yeah. oh yeah. I know I said that the gorget would never get topped and I'm not saying that this tops the gorget, but this is a heck of a find. I got one in situ. I think Jason just hollered. Let's go. Oh man. What's up guys? We're back out here at the Native American Spring property to do some sifting and some digging for um, Native American artifacts. But before we get started digging, I wanted to address something that keeps coming up on all my social medias. And it's people saying that we're digging burial sites. I don't think I've addressed this fully in a video yet, so I'm going to address it now. I don't know if you see this behind me. When I first got permission to come out here to this property, I thought, like a lot of people, that this was just a terrace. But it's not. We've had three different family members of the people who own this property um, tell us the same thing. And that's that an archaeologist did come out here. I don't know how many years ago. I don't think it was very long ago. I think it was the 90s. And told them that this high spot that looks like a terrace is indeed where the natives buried their dead. I don't know if they dug here or if they just knew it. By looking at it i would assume they probably did do a test dig what's interesting about this mound i guess you would call it a mound it's sort of like snake mound i believe snake mound maybe is in an, in ohio but what's interesting about it is it runs a very long way a very long way and that's why i thought it was a terrace because i was like there's no way that that's a that that's a mound but that's what the archaeologist said. So no, we're not digging on any burials. And uh, yes, this property has been visited by an archaeologist. So it's, it's, it's been investigated and it's been documented. Let's go dig. We're back. Farmer got finished with what he needed to do out here. So we're back. I uploaded all my footage so i'm completely out of footage so i'm hoping that we uncover some stuff today we might get a little bit today. i know this feller will i'll do my best and that feller even if i'm just running around filming i'll be fine jason's got some water he's got to get out yeah, of his I hole. Got a wet hole looks like a sinkhole marlin's hole feels good to be back here i know it was hard not to go to that other property but we found we have found so much stuff here that we've got to keep and we had to fill our holes in so Let's uh, let's get started, and I feel like something good's gonna come out. You guys stick around. Onward. Well, guys, I widened my hole. I found a few pieces of pottery, uh, a broken point, but I just found a pretty cool base to a capina. I was gonna show you. I'm trying not to film a lot of broke stuff, but this is a pretty big base. It's right there in the sifter. So you can see the telltale almost straight bottom tip snapped straight off i didn't bother to go get the water bottle for a broke but i promise you any whole ones that come out we're going to spray for y'all because y'all been telling me that you like it when we spray them so just want to show you that and uh yeah let's get back to digging onward all right well marlon and jason are on the board i had to go take care of some stuff and i'm going to show you guys what they found while i was gone two capinas oh nice is that not something yeah it is right there is bad in the ball and you hold hold this one up to the sun and really look at it all right <laughs> look at that guys and jason's got one over here he said that it might be his best one yet from this site, so I haven't seen it yet. So I'm gonna film my face, and then I'll when he shows it to me, and then I'll flip it down to you his hand. Spray it first. Yeah, go ahead. All right. Look at that. <laughs> wow. Mm mm mm. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus smoker that is needle that, that's what the, that's what it is a needle tip capena mm -mm -mm. 
<laughs> That's sexy, ain't it? Yeah. <laughs> And it almost ain't worth showing you, but it's a cool little tool of some kind. Yeah? Maybe a thumb scraper or something? Or, or I just think a they made like an awl or something out of a broken capena. Yeah, it could be. And look at this tool. That's, uh, that's, yeah, that's cool too. Work that off. That's man. definitely I had awl. cleaned it off. It's all worked down the side of it. Too. Yeah. That's a cool Dang. tool there. That could have been what? That may be what the inscribed gorgeous is this with. Yeah, I mean, well, sorry I didn't get them live, but I wasn't here, so, but hopefully we got more daylight left, so maybe we'll get some live digs for y'all, or at least some like, in the moment digs. I gotta get, I gotta get the shoveling. Onward. Well, the hole groweth. Here's a pile of broken stuff and pottery that I've found. Finally got into some pottery. One spool pile, two spool pile. I told you guys that I wasn't gonna film too many broken ones, but this is some pretty material. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna let Jason spray it right quick. Let's have it. Look at that stuff with the spots in it. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Man, that's a shame. Man. Here's Jason's progress. He's got a little step down going. Yeah, I got some <laughs> he's got, work with now. Looks like he's coming crawling out of a volcano. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's not a whole lot of sun, but yep, it's the kind of day I've been having right there. All right, onward. When I say this is the day I'm having, look at this tip. <sighs> Do you see it? Leave a comment at the time mark where you see this thing. It's right there, crazy. What took you so long? Good God. Chip, let's go through this together. Big old piece of pottery. Let's see if there's anything else over in here. Piece of pottery. Now we're back at the Capena Hill, so y'all y'all can't be expecting gorgets every time that we uh, I make a video. We're gonna get back to that property at some point, but well, that was two pieces of pottery and a stinking heartbreaker. Onward, I'm finally on the board. Do you see it? Tell me when you see it. I know Jason I spot it. it. <laughs> that looks like it's gonna be a pretty cool one, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, I believe so. It's not over there, guys. It's right there. Ooh. Let's get me out of my dirt. Let's get over here in the sunlight. Yeah. See a little light on the thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Yep. What is that? Made of. I don't know. Weird looking kind of, stuff. Got some mixed stuff in it, don't it? What in the world? <laughs> what in the world is that made out of? I don't know. Is, is that a capena? I guess it, it is. Looks, I mean, it's a little different, but it's probably made by them. Little tiny chip thing, but yeah. it'll be alright. I'll show it to Marlin right quick and I'll get back to it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that is pretty. See that stuff mixed in with it? Oh, yeah. yeah. I guess it's just how that formed. Yeah. That looks like the peanut to me. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's beautiful. Cool. That's, yeah, that's, that's beautiful. beautiful. That's a cool one. I haven't found one like that yet. Onward. The sun is getting low. Literally the next sift. Do you see it? It's right there, guys. Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Look at oh, yeah. a long base. Yeah. Man. Now, it's been about two and a half oh, weeks since a I've had two. one, man. Got Look that at curve. That. 
It's like that rose color. Oh my oh. goodness. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Look at them stripes. Oh yeah. Man, that is a bad one. Oh my knife. goodness. Look at that. Oh um, my! Look at those. That dude. That is the pretty. I think that's the prettiest material I've ever. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Look at that. Beautiful. Gosh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Look at that. That might be the prettiest one I have found. Onward, as far as material goes. Onward. Yeah, Marlon said I got one, but I don't. I don't know if it's film worthy. I said, Well, what's wrong with it? He said it's got a little side thing. And I, I looked at it. I said, Good God, let me go get the camera. <laughs> Looks like it's like that old crossbow, but maybe they did it on purpose. It's possible. <laughs> Dang, that's nice. That's pretty material. Real yeah. Beautiful black shirt. Let me ask y'all something while, you, while you're spraying that off. Have y'all seen many videos of folks finding Capena stuff? I haven't either. I, I, I've been with people that have found them, but just random finds. Cause I'd never right. even heard of it until we got on this and y'all yeah. looked it up. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, that's a pretty point right there. Yeah. I wonder if it didn't do that purposely. It's Who knows? almost symmetrical. Yeah, it? it is. I mean, that's kind of strange. Them boys at Pine Belt Relics always give you the kill shot. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Marlon, congrats. Right, My wife just called me right before uh, I finished that sift. So. I'm about to sift it and then we're gonna go onward. Jason yelleth, so I must goeth. Oh yeah. Dang. It's a nice oh, look one. Look at that torch in it. Yeah. That's a nice one. Almost the way it's shaped almost looks like a little knife. It may be. I, think it I might believe be. it is because it ain't really got an edge uh -huh. on that side. I think it's a little knife. Yeah, that's cool with them little ears on it. Yeah. That's, that'd make an awesome little knife. Yeah, check this one out, Marlon. Let me check her out. It's an awesome little knife, I believe. Just the way that one edge is. Oh, yeah. That's that's really nice. Yeah, boy, they beveled that edge off. It sure yeah. did. That is really Did you imagine nice. that on like a little fork horn antler? Oh, yeah. That'd be beautiful. Wouldn't it be beautiful? Man. We're getting in it. All right. All right, guys. Onward. Well, as you can see, I've moved some dirt. My hole has grown, and I just popped one out of the wall. I didn't think it was film worthy at first, but I like it. I'm gonna take my glove off. Let me set you down for a second. And spray it off right quick here it is before it's cleaned up some dang notches on the side i don't know because they had something in there they couldn't have got out it's a pretty cool point yeah i like it i kind of like them notches on the side something different yeah yeah, Heck yeah. Dude, it's hard work, but my God, it is rewarding. Yeah, we've had a pretty good day. Yeah. You guys know the drill. No gorgets or nothing. But... No gorgets, but we're going to get back there, and we're going to find us one. Onward. Well, I just pulled out some kind of little tool. I'm not sure if it was a point they couldn't get to work right, and they turned it into a little scraper or what, but I wanted to uh, show you that, and... Kind of show you this layer that i'm trying to get through so that i can go deeper Ow, it's kind of dark down here but uh <clears throat> i wasn't gonna go get the water but probably a scraper of some sort maybe there's a layer of rock right here and i don't want to use the big shovel because i'm gonna break something Heartbreaker. Jason just rolled out a heartbreaker, it sounds like. See how compact it is? You can just hear it. Just 
rock, a layer of rock. Yeah? yeah? It's broke, but you may want to film it. Okay, hold on just a second. He said I may want to film it even though it's broke. Must be a pretty good piece. Anyways, let's walk over there and see what he's got. You think that's a scraper? Yeah, I'd say a scraper. Yeah. I mean, it could have been a little knife. Well, yeah, I'd say a scraper. That half moon yeah. shape. Oh, man. All right. Rip it. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh look at those lines. Oh, my God. Look at that. Oh, man. Why? Good God. Dude, that thing might have been five inches long. Oh. Uh, while you're here, I got one in here I was wanting. It's just a base, but if we're going to... Give me some water on that one. Oh, my God. <laughs> that was before I left earlier. I just didn't want to pull the camera out because I wanted to get in the zone. Dang. Capena Hill. Yes, sir. That's two major heartbreakers right there. Those would have been magnificent. Yes. Yeah. Onward, but not for much longer because my back's about had it. I've yeah, been sifting off my knees. There. Yeah, I know Jason's wore out too. Yep. But a uh, little bit longer. I'm not through yet. Mm. Onward. <laughs>